friends, my name is Grace and today I wanted to do a University of Kentucky Johnson Hall dorm room tour because when I was in high school and I was thinking about going to Kentucky or especially when I found out I'd be living in Johnson, I looked up on YouTube for like dorm tours so that I could see how I could use the space or what it looked like in a video and there were none. So I just thought it would be helpful to post one since there's literally none on YouTube. I only saw ones for Jewel or like the Woodland Glens because they have the bigger beds and whatever. So yeah, I just thought it would be helpful to people because I know I would have wanted this. But this is going to be a little bit different because um, this is kind of the Corona edition, I'm going to call it. Because usually in Johnson, there is two twin beds in a room that share a bathroom with another room with two twin beds. So it'd be four people total sharing the bathroom in the middle or like I would have a roommate, but because of coronavirus, they put one person in each room. So yeah, I was definitely able to maximize my space really well because of that. And I like took apart the other bed and stuff. Little background, I'm a freshman at Kentucky right now and I came in as a pre-nursing major, but I actually recently switched it to marketing with a minor in psychology because it's just so much more up my alley. Also, I'm from the suburbs right outside of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. It's about like a 35 minute drive into the city. So that's about 10 hours away from here. So it's definitely a big change being here. This intro is getting really long though. So let's head into the video. Okay, so right when you walk in, you have the double sink vanity. It does have a lot of counter space. And luckily, since I'm in here by myself, I got to use both of the cabinet spaces underneath and all four of those drawers. So right here I just keep masks and I use, I'm pretty sure this is a towel hook, but I use it for masks because, you know, that's what's needed right now. But I just keep my little wall and AirPods here so that when I leave for the gym and stuff, I grab them. And then I just have stuff that I use daily out. I try to keep it like very clean because it'll literally make your life 10 times easier. I just have my Bath and Body Works soap. It's the Almond Blossom one. It's so good and it's like such a cute packaging. Face wash. This tissue box cover is from Marshalls, I'm pretty sure. And so is the Q-tip holder. But yeah, it just looks like that on the right side. And then here, I just keep my um, vitamins and like supplements in this little thing. This might be from Target, I'm pretty sure. Then I have again, like just the stuff I use daily. I try to keep this like really not cluttered at all. Just have my Quip toothbrush, the Hello Charcoal toothpaste, moisturizer, dry shampoos, brushes, perfumes. And then on the left side, my mini blender, paper towels, another soap, just a little candle for decor but then this side i have all of my cleaning supplies pretty much that i use and like a dish wand to clean dishes just your usual stuff and under my like beauty side vitamins extra shampoo and conditioner and hand towels and all that stuff and then in the middle i just keep like skincare makeup this is like medicine, vitamins, all that stuff. Um, here I just have like extra soaps and extra razor blades and stuff. And then down here I have just kind of like travel size things I can use, Q-tips, cotton balls. Also, I hang my hand towel over like the drawer part of that and it works out really well because it's in between the sinks then. This is just a little overview of the counter space. It is really nice to have that. And then you got this huge mirror right here, which is really nice too. So the second bed would be right here, but my parents and I took it apart and put it under my bed right there so that I could make this into a living space. Also, there was two desks, so the other desk is taken apart and in one of my closets. But the second desk chair we couldn't figure out, so I just have two desk chairs over there. Starting on this side here, right there, are, you know, body size mirror. And then they give you a microwave and fridge. And yes, it looked like that right there when I got it. It's gross, but I tried to clean it off, nothing worked. Right here, I just keep my Keurig with my little syrups that are like zero calories, but they're so good. 
and that's Metal Coffee Station. As you can see, this is from um, Marshalls or Home Goods. A lot of things in here are from there. Fridge, this is the freezer. I pretty much just keep frozen fruit in there for smoothies and then these little Trader Joe's things that are so good. Oh my God, this looks so gross, but it's how it came and nothing will clean up. You'd be sharing this the roommate usually but i'm not because they put one person in the room and then in the fridge mine came broken right there like it should have one of these but whatever pretty much just keep my bretta almond milk some random food i highly recommend getting a bretta i got one this semester which is the second semester so first semester i did not have one and it literally like saves using so many water bottles moving on this is my little living space these carpets it's actually two but i tried to make them look like one and they're from home goods i'm pretty sure marshall's are home goods basically all this stuff the coffee table is from ikea i'm pretty sure it's like a kid's desk but i made it work as a coffee table looks like that that's just kind of like my junk little box, like throw random stuff in there. I usually keep a candle there. You're not allowed to do that though, so don't do that. And then this, I have no idea where it's from. My mom bought it. Couch, also from Ikea. I bought this when I was like literally in maybe sixth grade and it was like hundreds of dollars. First like big girl purchase. But I guess it was a good purchase because I bought a gray slip cover also at Ikea. Now I can use it in here. So yeah, couch from Ikea, these pillows, the fluffy pillows are from Marshalls, and that pillow I'm pretty sure is also from Marshalls. This throw blanket is from At Home. This canvas painting is also, again, from Marshalls. <laughs> this little side table, I'm pretty sure my mom found it at a thrift store or something, but it's Ethan Allen, so she was like, we have to get it. Like, it's such good quality, blah, 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 so we got it. So this is just my little side table. I keep chocolates in those little ceramic things. I'm not really sure where they're from, but yeah, they're like literally dog bowls, I'm pretty sure, because there's a paw print on the inside. Here I keep the book I'm reading, which I actually just finished this book. It was pretty good. And those are my blue light glasses. Really cute coasters. Again, from Marshalls, what's new? This is a picture that my sister made for me, like for my birthday or something. She literally like made it. And it's like my friend Julie and I. This lamp, so cute. It's my favorite thing. This part actually used to glow, but it burned out. That's also from Marshalls, I think. This my mom made, and I just keep candles behind there, but you like, can't see them. Normal eye level. Up here, these are my curtains. This is a curtain rod. You're not allowed to hang things like with nails, so use command hooks. The rod, it's um, marbled at the end, which I really loved. It's so cute. And then these curtains, I keep them like that all the time to the side. Also both from Marshalls. Side note, my Christmas lights burned out, so that's why they're not on. This chair is from my sister's dorm room when she was a freshman and it's like gray, but I like a lot of white, so I put a throw blanket over it. These are gonna be like literally your best friend in college, the little Bath and Body Works wallflowers. All right, moving to this side of the room. This is my bed area side, whatever you wanna call it. My suitcase is here, and I honestly I like to keep them out. I don't have anywhere else to put them anyway, and I love traveling, so I like keeping them out because it reminds me that I want to travel. Over here, I'll keep water bottles. I don't go through them that much anymore though because I bought that Brita. Here I have, this is such a good like adapter thing to plug into your outlet because it gives you literally six more outlets and like these two USBs. So usually you'll have one of these. My other one of these is in my closet, which you'll see, but I wouldn't have both usually. Like your roommate would have the other one. Right here, I just have this picture frame with a picture of my boyfriend and I from New Year's Eve. This cute lamp, also picture frame and lamp, Marshalls. This my mom like made because we couldn't find like the perfect fake white flowers. I don't know, she made that. And then here I have a picture of my friends, Mac, Jackie, and Julie. And then pictures of my boyfriend and I in Miami and at our favorite restaurant, Davio's in King of Prussia. So good, such a good restaurant. And then I just have a little candle, my Vaseline, and a little journal book. 
So this is my bed. This throw blanket I think is from like Sam's Club, but it's like literally so nice. It's like the softest thing ever. The white comforter I already had from my house when I was little and I had twin beds. I believe this pillow is from Marshalls and I think these two are from at home. And then just white pillows, white sheets. I like everything being pretty white. That is from, again, our shoals or home goods. And then a little window curtain thing. That like fits inside, like it suctions to the sides. So you're not like drilling anything. It's really cute and it worked out well. Moving on to my desk area, it looks a little chaotic right now, but so again, like I said, I have two chairs because there's supposed to be two people in here. And I just keep like tape. Those are two books I read a few weeks ago, semester so far. This lamp is from, um, again, Home Goods or Marshalls. <laughs> Clock, also from Home Goods or Marshalls. I don't think I've ever put it up. Like that time is wrong. I have no idea what's going on. Kentucky gives you an iPad and Apple Pencil. That's why I have like those packages. And that's when I bought my laptop. Whiteboard, I've never written anything on here, but you know, it's definitely a good thing to have. Just markers for that. Pictures of me and my boyfriend, Polaroid looking things. Now, this is my dog, Lily, we used to have, and she was the cutest little thing ever. She was a Maltese. We miss her dearly. Just extra candles, more pictures. I just have like random pictures everywhere. It's pretty much my desk space. Under here, I, I brought this filing cabinet with me and it holds like all these school supplies, which I've never used because everything is like online. This is the view when you're sitting on the couch. A little TV stands from Ikea. I have my mini disco ball right there. It's fun. Wrapping paper I used earlier in the year. Four little glasses for whatever. My TV, I pretty much just use it for Spotify and Netflix. I don't really watch TV, but just to play music on, it's so helpful. And then behind my TV is like my recycling corner. <laughs> That's pretty much it. So when you walk in right there, you have these two closets, which again, usually you'd get one, your roommate would get the other, but I get both because one person in this room right now. That Marshalls are home good. Also, side note, these little hooks are so helpful. They're command hooks, but they're silver. So they look really nice, but they're literally command hooks. So they just stick to your door and will come off. I have one there. It holds my bag and like sweatshirt. I open my first closet. I have another one in here to put my bathrobe on. This closet is pretty much closed. Like these are like shirts and sweaters and then Here's some sweatshirts. Yes, it's color coordinated because I'm a psycho. I have my shoes that I wear most of the time, like those to the gym every day, so they're like on the top of the basket. Right here is usually my big laundry basket, but that's downstairs in the laundry room right now because I'm doing laundry. And then moving up here, all my laundry supplies are like trash bags, dryer sheets, fabric softener, ice cube trays I gave up on using because it's so annoying to fill them up. I have like two pots and pans to use for cooking stuff. Bottles for the bathroom, toilet paper, more masks because Corona. That's pretty much it for that. Right here I have a scale that barely works. I mean it works, but like you left to tell when you'll be five pounds lighter, so it's super unreliable. And then I have my backpack, which I only used first semester because I had one in-person class. And this semester I'm online, so I haven't touched that. I kind of just use it for traveling, like the airport and stuff. Behind this mirror, I have a stockpile of Celsius, which is the best like pre-workout energy drink ever. If you've never heard of it, you're missing out because they're literally the best. Just stuff like doesn't fit in my fridge. I have literally a grocery store. I buy so many groceries. Like, I have so many seasonings, like why? And <laughs> popcorn, a lot of quinoa, protein powders for my smoothies, oats. I made banana oat pancakes the other day and they were so good. A lot of almond milk, like literally a case of 12. Coffee, more food. I have a lot of, this is like my nut cabinet right there, <laughs> like actually. And a bunch of RX bars. This flavor is really good. Snacks, smart sweets, chocolate, Ziploc bags, whatever. And up here I have my dishes, glasses, mixing bowl with like kitchen utensils in it, plastic silverware stuff. And that's my second dresser. I just have like clothes in there. And then on the side, I shove like extra stuff that won't fit. I really recommend though getting Ba like baskets like that or whatever to put up because it helps you like organize your stuff more 
And then this is kind of all just like sitting on top of there, but it works. Close that. Again, a little overview. This is the vanity area. Bed, a little living space. And then on this side, you have your two closets. And all the dimensions and stuff are posted on the website. That's how I like planned everything out without seeing it before. I share the bathroom with one other person who lives in the room next to me. So we share the shower in the bathroom. I'm gonna do a little like quick overview in there, but it's also like her space and stuff. So I'm not really gonna talk. I'm gonna insert actually right oh my god I'm like rambling I'm gonna insert a video when I got here what it looked like so that you guys can see like when you walk in and move in exactly what the room looks like and how like I use the space hope you got some like ideas from this video and yeah I don't know it just helps I feel like seeing it, like, I couldn't believe there was not one Johnson room tour on YouTube, but now there is, so, yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me know in the comments what you thought, if you have questions, where stuff is from, or anything about Kentucky. Like and subscribe if you want, if you liked it. Thanks for watching.